Okay, everyone. Much technical difficulty today. <laughs> um, okay, hello and welcome to More Than Organized Monday. Sorry I'm late. Technical difficulties. I'm Miriam and today we're talking about loving your work and energizing your life. How about that? <laughs> Pretty cool, right? What if, sorry, I'm just getting my notes. All these technical difficulties made me lose my notes. Okay, so there's this thing that happens when people think that they have all this work to do and they have all this life to do and it gets overwhelming because you think it's separate and you got to do more and more and more. Instead of finding the common threads, what it is about your work and your life that you really love and how can you get that into alignment so that whatever you're working on feels good and joyful and brings more energy um, to every situation, right? What if doing one thing charged you up for the other thing? And then you could actually feel more productive and satisfied at the end of the day. Wouldn't that be cool? So what you want to do is find that common thread. What is the piece that you love about everything you do? This is going to be um, harder for some of you than others, but there's going to be something you really enjoy. So look towards entertainment. What do you love about entertainment? For me, it's the story. How is the story told? Is it making the right use of the medium for the story to be told? Is it developing the characters? Is it being well received? Is there subtle subplots and such intrigue going on in the background? I love a good story. That's why I watch TV. That's why I learn from movies and TV and documentaries. Um, but there's other things that have been common throughout my life. When I was a kid, I loved to play archaeologist and detective agency and restaurant and all of those things had systems, discovery, um, a little bit of research and analysis involved. And um, that's what I bring to my work as an entrepreneur and an organizer and a coach, right? It's all those different pieces of the puzzle. So what if you could figure out a couple of those things that allowed you to enjoy your work more, even when it's in the grind phase, and you could have more energy at home and when you're doing your life things because you're very aware of the enjoyment of it instead of the drudgery of it or the oh, it's just one more thing what if it's so that you can do other things so that you have the resources to do the rest of your life and better work what if all of that could be found in the same way by bringing your work and your life and your enjoyment all into alignment so whatever you're working on feels good the overwhelm automatically gets less all right i'm going to keep it short for today because of the technical difficulties but i'd love to hear what you think about these things in the comments and um yeah in the meantime don't forget to subscribe like follow turn on your notifications and tell all your friends to join us next week because it's all about having a delightful day <laughs>